Hey guys, I've had a lot of people ask uh, about comparing the Powerfilm 220 watt solar, solar blanket with a 300 watt solar blanket. So uh, I've got them laying on the ground right here. I've got an Anchor Powerhouse 767 showing you. Right now our 300 watt solar blanket is plugged in. We've got 79 watts going in. Uh, here's the cable. You can see it leading to the 300 watt. And, you know, 81, 82 got a really cloudy day here right now so I'll just kind of show you in low light conditions 86 okay well, that's not bad 90 okay so just the clouds are breaking through a little bit right now 92 and then uh, we'll just compare it here in a moment to the power film just to see so here unplug that you can see the cable leading to the power film 220 watt let's just plug this guy in so that's in now. Power film takes a couple moments to, to kind of click in. So we saw 92 watts as a max. Again, that's what we got. So we got 42, 64. It'll creep up a little bit. I'll do this a couple times just uh, because the cloud covers 62. Okay, so it's a difference of about 30 watts. But like I said, I'll plug it in and out a couple two three times just to give it uh, just a, a fair comparison but here's here's a walk around just to show you so this is the power film 220 the larger one on the left and then our 300 watt solar blanket which is our newest product which is some power gen 3 solar cells with 24.5 percent efficiency rating some power solar cells are going to be the closest to comparison to amorphous cells that uh, power film uses for use in low light conditions which we had definitely have today but you could fit i would say about three approximately give or take three of our 300 watt solar blankets in the same space that a power film 220 watt takes up so to kind of give you perspective and weight wise we've come up with a new material our 300 watts have this our 300 watts are 13.2 pounds that's how that's the weight which literally makes us the lightest solar blanket on the market now the power film 220 watt is i think it's 14.2 so just call it 14 pounds but that's a difference of almost a almost a pound so that makes quite a bit of a difference right there let's just kind of see where we're at for readings now so power film 60 watts going in let's just unplug so again, you can see the cable here for the power film. Unplug it. Now this is the cable for our 300 watt. Plug this guy in. So that's in. And now we're just going to compare and see the difference. And I'll probably do this one more time just to see. Just takes a moment with where we're at. It's already 67, 68. Yeah, again, just depends on the cloud cover. We don't know the density of the clouds above us, so it's kind of really tough to give an exact comparison. But either way, it is it is definitely surpassing what the power film is doing. Um, other than that, price point-wise, our 300 watt is less money um, by about $1,600. So you're looking at the power film is just under $3,600 US. Our 200 watt solar blanket is just under $2,000 US. So that's a huge difference. You could almost buy two of our 300 watt solar blankets so for almost the same price. So you could have 600 watts versus 220 watts. And as you can see, it works extremely well in low light conditions. Um, yeah, so here, again, same. This is our 300 watt plugged in, 68 watts. Again, just depends on the cloud cover. And here again, you can see the cable that I'm doing. This is the power film. So let's plug that in. And by the way, on top of the anchor, you can see the size. This is it. That's it. That's our 300 watt solar blanket right there. So power film, 49 watts. It might creep up just a little bit. I'll, I'll go there in a second. The other thing about our solar blankets, um, let me just flip this over, I'll show you. You have the ability, 
we have two high-speed USB charging ports, a USB Type-C and a DC. So what that translates to is you don't even need a larger battery pack like this, uh, this Anchor Powerhouse or any of the others. And you can actually charge devices directly from the back of our solar blankets. And it is smart circuitry, so it knows when to cut off. Our USB Type-C, if you have a newer laptop or MacBook, it'll actually charge directly from the back on that. Just so you're aware. And we're still hovering. Here's the power film. Sorry, just kind of trying to get the right angle so you can see 49 watts. So yeah, that gives you uh, an idea there, guys. Uh, we are going to have the 300 watts in stock. I did post it'll be first week of May. Realistically, it should be last week of April is when we're going to have these in stock and available for you. So definitely, if you have any questions on them, please let me know. Uh, we are selling out of what we have coming uh, fast. A lot of people are buying our 300 watt solar blankets along with our 220 watts. But if you have any questions on it, please let us know. If you want to order one to hold one for you before we do sell out, I do highly recommend that. Um, they are available. Any questions regarding doing a custom package, we can definitely do that for you. I am going to post a video here uh, very shortly. I actually ran a, a freeze dryer overnight uh, for over, it was close to 48 hours, with a, uh, a Zender, um, what is it, their, their 6400 with an expansion battery so it was 12,800 watt hours did it more so just for me but I, I wanted to post a video just to show people that first <laughs> those things are power hungry but anyway i'm i'm digressing uh, i'll do a video on that and show everybody so um any questions let me know uh if you want to order let us know uh easiest is to reach out and shoot me an email if you're outside of north america we will ship to you our website's currently not set up for shipping so i'll have to manually do up an invoice um just shoot me an email let me know what you're looking for or what you want to charge and then i will uh manually do up an invoice for you okay have a, a great day guys i will post this here this week uh hopefully everybody's having a great easter uh we're taking advantage and again really cloudy day what we have here right now okay we'll talk to you soon and uh please like and subscribe to our videos um i, I do my best to provide you know meat and potatoes content not a lot of fluff and real world insight on how I use products, which I do believe a lot of people uh, would as well too, and they would find value in it. Okay, talk to you soon, guys. Bye then.